Thursday, Friday, Saturday, May 23rd, 24th, and 25th. Dare I say it, happy birthday. Yes, the sun is in Gemini and the moon is in Aquarius. Oops, it goes like that. Gemini, Aquarius. You can make as many mistakes as you want. A Gemini and Aquarius, fast, funny, witty. I had a husband who passed away and he had this configuration. And one day he looked at me at the subway and he said, Deborah, were you looking in the mirror when you put your makeup on? Is that supposed to be funny? That's so Gemini Aquarius and I just made me laugh so hard. Like, I think you were insulting me or were you complimenting me? I didn't quite get it. That's the nature of double air. They can say the funniest lines. They're charming. They're funny. They're talkative. This is a great few days to get yourself into verbal gifted words. Now, think about Deborah Silverman, Tommy Chong, Bob Dylan. We're all in good company, May 24th. We are the people that use, look at me. My mouth becomes this little instrument that puts words together and I listen and afterwards I'm like... Wow, Dad, that was pretty good. Tommy Chong told me that when he opens up the fridge and the light comes on in the middle of the night, he thinks he's performing and he starts doing a little act because that's the Gemini energy is we just love to entertain. And as soon as the lights are on, we're like all over it talking to ourselves. And if your moon's in Aquarius, you love talking to yourself. But the point of this exercise with these two combinations is they don't care what you think. They're individuals, they're unique, they're funny, and dare I say it, charming. So enjoy Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. This weekend is social, it's verbal, it's studying, it's reading, it's documentaries, it's Netflix. You can do it all at the same time. Have the television on, have the computer on, the phone's ringing, there's the dog, and oops, I forgot I was baking bread. That is Gemini Aquarius, brought to you by Deborah Silverman, Lifetime on Astrology Answers.